very important relevant table as we know unfortunately the world claims that Israel are conquerors kibush the conquer the land of the Palestinians and they are about to build settlements because the land does belong to them belongs to the Palestinians definitely all this is a result of not believing the Torah which says clearly that God promised the land to Israel so this table very interesting table which really shows that the land of Israel belongs to Israel and many interesting things we have to do also at this time of redemption as we said next year which is sabbatical year 775 amazingly everything comes so we were looking for best meetings of the world Eretz Israel coming Israel and next year which is very suitable year as we said for Messiah for redemption for the end of time which coming also gets and then we looked on what really is written in these verses and we saw clearly that verses we clearly says Tavo they will come at Eres Meshbotechem will come to the, your land of your settlement Asher Ani Noten Lachem that I give to you and then other verses say the same thing Asecha is your land Asher Hashem Lokechem is your land which God gave to you not the United Nations definitely not Obama and others and then comes the warning yeah you will come, you will inherit the land, the good land, but in condition, Shamu, Achem Pintishkihuet, Brit Hashem Elokechem, be careful that you will not forget the covenant of God, which is keeping the Shabbat, keeping the Torah, commandments, Asher Karatim, that He did with you. So, unfortunately, as a result of not believing in the Torah, this is exactly the situation. The whole world claims Israel is a, the robbers, the conquered land, which is not theirs, so they should give it back. And we know now what is going on for that today, more and new excommunication against settlements and so on. Definitely, is no answer to politics, only one answer that God created the world and He promised the land to Israel, Ibn Israel of Israel to come to the land but in conditions that he keeps the Torah. Looking more into this table, very interesting we find here twice the Mashiach you have Mashiach coming here clearly with the warning to keep the Torah also Pesach with the time for redemption and also in another time you have Mashiach small skip, only two letters in interesting verse which says that in future God will take revenge from those the enemies of Israel, of Israel will messianize those who are causing hatred to me, to the Torah, to Yeshiva boys, I will pay. And then comes again, Oyev, Ashashaf, this PLO, the enemy, and then comes, Arninu Goyem Amo, Kidam Avda Vikor. You all the world sing and praise God, because he will take revenge from his enemies. Interesting also that comes here, Ben Yosef, it means he's the Messiah of Ben Yosef, Ben David, Ben Yosef, two Meshachim, maybe this is why twice Messiah, Meshach, appears here. And then, amazingly, we have this promise of God in Egypt to the Jews, Pakod Yifkod Elohim, that God will redeem you. And as our Rebbe said, the same thing, like in Egypt, it is redeemed. The same thing, it is the same kind of redemption, will be also in future. So amazing to see clearly, and this is the only answer to the world if not believing the Torah so unfortunately yeah the world is right Jews are conquerors it takes the land which is not theirs so only keeping the Torah believing in God will save us from all these troubles that we have today and especially as we say that we are now really coming in the year 775 in this Year 775, which is next year, sabbatical year, very popular time for Mashiach, but the condition keeps the Torah. So, important table, relevant table, and really this is the answer to the whole world. Without the Torah, 
is no answer, and definitely the situation will be very, very severe as with, from day to day. You see another extreme equation against Israel, not making business with settlements and so on. And who knows what will be the continuation? So let us hope that really Jews will realize that only the Torah is the basis for our existence from the land of Israel.